So, uh, I get a lot of comments in my video about like not being able to run the game or having questions about run and running the game. And so I thought I'd throw together a quick video on how you can kind of see where your where your specs are going to line up. This is this website here. I'll have it linked in the uh, description of the video so that you can go ahead and come here for yourself. If you have a CIG account, you can log in and it will find your GPU and CPU. And then according to this list here, it'll put a gold dot where you are. This is where I'm at. I have the 1080 and a 7700K. So as you can see, I'm running below or above minimum, but a little bit below the uh, recommended. And it's cool because you can see uh, I'm below the recommended on the CPU, but I'm above the recommended on the GPU. So you can kind of see if you what you want to upgrade. Uh, another couple things to note is if you click on it, it tells you your average FPS. So if you have a certain FPS that you're shooting for, like right above the recommended here, you're getting 35.6, but it's probably a lot smoother. But you can kind of go over here and you can uh, you can kind of check to see what people are running and what kind of FPS they're expecting. So like if you have any of these graphics cards and if these processors, you could be expecting 45.5. And if you want to shoot for a specific FPS, you can kind of check around like 50.8 is the highest right now. And that's running some pretty, pretty top of the line processors and stuff. So. But you can kind of, if you want to upgrade your PC to be able to play Star Citizen or you're wondering if you should, this is a good resource that you can check. You can also click the outlying data and then you get this huge, huge chart. Uh, unless you're using some really weird hardware, I recommend you didn't do that. But a couple things to note, uh, I run 32 gigs of RAM. This game is uses a lot of RAM, so if you're running 8 or 16, that might be something you have to upgrade. And also, I have an SSD, which is you pretty much need that from what I've heard. I've not tried to run it on a hard drive, like a normal disk hard drive, but I've heard it's pretty rough. But if you want to check to see if your RAM's what's holding you back, a good way to do that is you can hit the Windows key on your keyboard and G and it'll pull this up and then you can go to performance. And while you're in the game, you can see how many gigs of RAM you're using. And so if you have a bunch of if you're at 100, that could be limiting your frame rate as well. So that's something also to pay attention to. I haven't had any issues with 32 gig, but like I've looked at it while I've been playing and I've been hitting 12 gig without running very much in the background. So if you're running into issues, this is also a good thing to check. But anyway, I hope you all found this video helpful. Uh, if you have any more questions, let me know in the comments. Uh, thank you for watching.